Have you heard the claim that we can't trust nutritional research because there's conflicting data? I've been met with this claim numerous times and honestly it just feels like a convenient excuse to disregard data and place focus on less reliable evidence such as anecdotes. We all know there are conflicting findings in health research. In fact, even with smoking, there's some research suggesting that smoking is associated with a lower risk of lung cancer. But that doesn't mean we should throw our hands up in the air, say there's conflicting research, and just assume that smoking is safe. Instead, we have to ask why there are conflicting findings and dive into the finer details of the studies. Were they comparing those smoking 10 cigarettes a day to those smoking 9 cigarettes a day? Because I wouldn't expect to see a significant difference in risk in that case. Did they adjust for other lifestyle and socioeconomic factors which may impact the results? And when we look at those details, we can usually figure out why these results differ from other studies. And by doing so, we can figure out which research is of higher quality. The same applies to nutrition research. We need to look at details like the dose, what the food is being consumed in place of, if other factors were adjusted for, and if the results have been replicated. And when we consider all of that, we can almost always tease out why there are conflicting findings and provide more nuanced recommendations to the public. So when I hear this, there are conflicting findings though, especially from people who should know better, like some of our carnivore friends with medical degrees, it just comes off as lazy and a sign of a lack of science literacy.